Midwest Star TV. drummer how what kind of direction you said something about more positive it's, direction well i mean i'm always gonna be a negative lyricist but we made him do live. two songs without saying a cuss word i mean that's that's a, that's a that's record, a, fucking that's a. A record. <laughs> fucking a. Oh, so in the third song he says i gotta say fucking this one so, you well, know. the new album we're working on revival uh yeah. it's gonna have everything man we got one song that's real ballady and like hopefully it'll make your fucking ass cry Hopefully. Um, hopefully. That's, hopefully. What, I'm, that's what I'm going Tears. for. It's not revival like like a church revival. It's okay. revival like, 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 like bring your ass back to Even life. though I have heard uh, you guys were on a, a Newton, was this a Newton Christian oh, station yeah. or something? Really? Yeah. As odd as that was, yeah. We were that's on Beth, awesome. Bethel College, you know. Yeah. I didn't burst into flames, which is a fucking miracle. <laughs> that's pretty sweet. So, you know, uh, nothing wrong with that, I guess. How did, how did you get hooked up with that thing? Actually, our former drummer's cousin. Oh, yeah, well. she uh, she's, she has a show there, man. It was really cool. I mean, it, it, you couldn't cuss and all that good shit, but uh, it really worked out. There's a lot of innuendo. There's a lot of innuendo, you know, you know. And she was really cool. She, she was really cool. Innuendo. She kept talking about her right. box. Yeah, her, her tight, box. her tight little box. Everybody can cram into it, you know that type of shit. Oh my I tell God. You. <laughs> And you missed this? I did, I did. I, well, like I said, it was our former <laughs> drummer's yeah, you know, have anything to cousin. That. You know, he got a hair up his Can't ass and me. was like, oh, this isn't going nowhere, and the music and this. I'm like, you're a drummer for three fucking years, all of a sudden it's the music. You know, but that's a that's a whole other fucking story. <laughs> we all don't have enough is, time for that. <laughs> you know. So, uh, talk to me about, about Wichita Metal Festival. I understand you guys are going to be involved. Yeah, you're yeah, we're actually heavily going, involved in this. Yeah, we're, we're going headlining with uh, King Shifter. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, I mean, it's about time somebody picked the fucking Metal Fest name back up. I know that another promoter did it for a while and failed. <laughs> it was going to be somewhere else, now it's back here, you know. Yeah, it was in Newton, but now it's here at the Lizard Lounge. Unfortunately, it's 21 to enter. We, we love all ages shows, but it's 21 to enter. Still going to be a great fucking show. Ten bands, ten bucks. <laughs> food, Where's a good food? place to do an all ages show? We need some new places. <laughs> yeah, no yeah. shit. Sure. You know any place good? No. Damn it. No. The, 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 the only... How about your house? And I, and I hate I hate to say this because I, I will probably draw some, Don't some say looks. It. Don't say it. But I will have to say that uh, the, old, the, the the last time I did a show, I held it in a bingo hall. I'm not sure if you've heard. Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you, man. <laughs> Fuck the bingo I, hall. I, I, I attempted. And bingo hall is actually kind of hey, cool. all I got to say... The, the acoustics building. were fabulous. The building's it, pretty fucking <laughs> Blue Felix. That's about all I got to say. That was about. awesome that they fucking was going to do it. I love Blue Felix, he's my boy Toxic, but all I know is that place did not have the power to barely fucking push our shit, let alone their fucking massive amount of shit. So, oh my god. But, you know, we stuck around, we did the show, like we said we would. Great, great acoustics, Unlike man. Some it was other a cool bands building. Like, fuck this, we're going to Hutchinson. Yes. You know, it's cool. They were named Nameless. 
<laughs> name, name. They knew who the fuck they are. And it's cool, man. It's cool. But, uh, you know, hopefully we get to fucking do a show with Blue Felix again. I'm a huge fan of those guys. Well, talk, like to me, a, talk to me about tonight with Spine Shank. Dude, what, what do you guys think? Spine thinking? Shank, dude. Yeah, honestly, okay, ass. put it this way. I pull into the fucking parking lot to unload. Help my bass player unload, because I'm a vocalist. I ain't got shit to unload. It's a pack of cigarettes. <laughs> but, uh... We pull up, and the first thing I see is Johnny Santos getting off the bus. How fucking cool is that? Pretty nice bus, too, man. Nice. I set him back a few bucks. Yeah. Someday you guys will have a bus like this. Hopefully. Right. Hopefully, Hopefully we'll probably some better gas mileage. <laughs> <laughs> it's got to be amazing gas mileage. Go green. Yeah. Go green. <laughs> wait, wait. What type of green are you talking about? Yeah. yeah, no. Well, uh... Social networking sites, Facebook, Twitter, all this yeah, stuff. Yeah, you guys are all, all over the place. www.facebook.com, the Evolution of Pain Band. That's the Facebook one. ReverbNation.com, backslash, forward slash, I don't know what the fuck's called. The Evolution. The Evolution of Pain. Uh, I think we still have a MySpace, MySpace don't we? The Evolution. Yeah, that's right. MySpace, The Evolution of Pain. Don't forget MySpace. Uh, we're on, we're, yeah, we're on Twitter at Tiop Wichita. Tiop Wichita. Uh, we're also on Vampire Freaks at the Evolution of Pain. Um, yeah, I've yeah. never heard of Vampire Freaks. Dude, you gotta go there, man. Dude, dude, we've been on that for like Vampire fucking Vampire four or five years. <laughs> don't, forget, uh, don't, me. don't forget Trainer Studios. Trainer Studios, Studios, you can go there. Yeah, there's the Evolution of Pain. Yeah, I heard uh, one of my photographers. I'm not sure who it was. It was either Aaron Fox or, or Chris Blank. <laughs> Said that he went over to your studio and he's like, that is the coolest fucking place on the planet. Right on. That's I, our spent third, bed. I, I spent five grand on foam alone. Make it <laughs> yep. Actually, make it sound right. See foam, that? foam looks good. You know what? Foam looks good. Not only is he a good drummer, but we inherited a fucking studio. Yeah. yeah. Look at that. Yeah. Everything works it's out, It's a right? trade-up. We record every time we practice. That's yep. right, man. When you fucking trade up, man, you better trade up, right? <laughs> That's right. right well, gentlemen, thanks for doing this. Thank nice you. chatting with you again. Thank you. And I think we'll see you at Wichita Metal Thanks Friday. for doing it in the shade. Metal Fest. Yes. <laughs> see ya. See ya.